With a calculated dimension, we can create a new dimension by creating functions with existing dimensions. In this example, we want to find out how much sales is associated to male and female customers, assuming that this information is encoded as the last digit of our customer ID. So first of all, I create a bar chart with sales as a measure. Then I go to create calculated dimension and select calculated dimension. I call this new dimension male slash female sales. The formula editor is similar to the calculated measure. So there are many functions, conditions and operators that we can use. We could for example concatenate two dimensions to one or split a dimension into two others and so on. For this case we want to use an if function. Just click on if or press Ctrl and the spacebar to get an overview of available functions with some practical tips how to use them. For an if function, we first have to define a condition. Then, separated with a comma, we determine the value if the condition is true. And finally, specify the value if the condition is false. In our case, the condition is that if the customer ID ends with the number 7, then it's a male customer, otherwise it's a female one. To determine the end of a string, there's a function that is called ends with. So I choose this function and type in customer ID. Alice, we get an error message below the editor because this is still not enough to define the dimension. We additionally have to type in a dot and then select customer ID and not the name. After the comma, we type in seven in quotes. That's it for our condition. After the first comma within the if function, we type in male and after the second comma, female. If there are no longer any error messages, the formula seems fine and we click on OK. Perfect, we have created a new dimension with a simple condition function that categorizes our sales into male and female customers. If you want to become the SAC expert in your team, then please check out my SAC masterclass on Udemy. Follow the link in the description and thanks for watching this video.